Hey guys, it's Ashley. I'm here with another Rainbow Beat for Pride Month this month. Um, I'm using the Armrest USA Remember Me palette. Okay, let's go. I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and start on out with Love Sick. This is a pretty red shade. I'm going to start out with putting that right here in the crease. hope y'all can see what I'm doing. Okay, I'm putting the red right there. Now that's done, I'm going with a shade called High Key. It's a really pretty orange shade. I'm going to put that after the red. Kind of blend the red and the orange together just a little bit. Okay, now that's done. Get that just a little bit more. Alright, now that's done. I am now, don't worry, I'm... Dusting off the brush as I go with a towel. I'm going with the shade called Soul. It's a really pretty yellow shade. Go in on that orange just a little bit there. Okay, now that's done. I'm going go in with the shade called Adventurer. Adventurer is a really pretty green shade. Alright, now I'm done with that. I'm going to go in with the shade called On Air. It's a baby blue shade. Okay. Now that's done. Y'all can see it's all pretty and blended. I'm going to take that brush, that same brush I just used, and of course go over the top with everything. Now that that's done, I'm going to take some of my Glamouflage um, Hard Candy Concealer and cut the crease. And to use that, I'm going to use this Smudger Brush from Moda. And I'm going to start cutting the crease. Cut the crease. I love cutting creases. It's like one of my favorite things to do. All right. Now I'm going to get this. Um, Real Techniques brush and just kind of, you know, not really set it, but just kind of, you know, pat it on there just a little bit. Okay. Uh, that's done. I'm going to go on the bottom do kind of like a wing thing here. I'm going with the shade called Love Strip. Just a little bit. Love struck. Then go with high key. And then soul. Fresh. A little tiny, tiny bit of on air. The corner. Right now, that's done. Kind of point it out just a little bit there. Hmm, should I connect it? I don't know. I'm gonna get the smudger brush again, wherever the hell I put it. Let's go over to that. Alright, now that's done. I like the way that looks so much. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm just really excited with how this looks coming out. I'm thinking we'll take some purple and go around here, but I'm not sure. So come with me really quickly as I look at my stuff. I would use a Wet n Wild foiled shadow, but I don't know. I'm going to take Jawbreaker palette. I'm going with a highlighting shade on the remaining. 
So, get Jawbreaker here. So sorry guys, I should be more organized. <laughs> this is the reality of it all. Okay, I got Jawbreaker opened up. I'll show y'all real quick. I'm thinking I'm gonna take the shade called Jawbreaker <laughs> and put it um, all over my eye with a smudging brush. Let me get the smudger brush. I'm going to go with the shade Jawbreaker with a smudging brush. Again, this is the shade Jawbreaker. I think this looks really pretty. Okay, now I'm thinking I'm going to take a little bit of the Uh Huh Honey palette from ColourPop, if I can find it here. I'm thinking I'm going to use the um, glitter shade in the middle of it. Hold on really quickly, you guys. I'm so sorry. I am not really organized at all, by all means. I'm thinking I'm going to take the shade Palooza. Actually, no. No, 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 no. I'm going to go in with this Moda Pro. Detailing brush, I'm going with a shade called Sunburst. Put it on the inner corner here. Like that. I think I'm going to take it on this really small detailed brush. Um, this fine liner brush. I'm going to go with a shade called Sunburst. Just follow the line. Again, that is sunburst. You can't really see it on camera. And I am so sorry. I just want to give it a little bit more pizzazz. Okay. I think I'm done. Hope you guys like that look.